everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing my homemade almond milk recipe. This is extremely easy and simple. All you need are some raw almonds. You can have them organic or not, depending upon your budget. So you want to soak one cup of almonds in water for eight hours. If you don't have eight hours, you can always pour hot water over the almonds and just soak them for two hours, but definitely don't soak them for longer than eight. After your almonds are done soaking, you definitely wanna rinse them off and dump out all the old water that they were soaking in. Now you can add five cups of fresh filtered water. I also add a pinch of salt, and if you want your almond milk to be sweetened, you can add maybe three or four dates, and if you want chocolate milk, you can add a tablespoon or two of cocoa powder along with the dates. Now I just blend it up in my Vitamix. I blend it for two minutes because I like my almond milk to be super, super creamy. Now this is a nut milk bag. You can also use cheesecloth. You can also use cheesecloth, but I will link this bag down below because I just got it off of Amazon and I love it. I can just wash it in the washing machine. And I'm pouring my almond milk in batches. You don't want to fill your bag up too, too tall because it'll be too hard to squeeze all the liquid out but I squeeze as much of the almond milk as I can out of the almonds, and then I dump the actual leftover almond particles into a bowl. You can dehydrate the almond like leftovers if you want and use it as almond meal, or I like to add it into my homemade gr keto granola, which I will link the recipe above and down below. That way you guys can check it out if you haven't made it yet, but it's a great like filler for things. Now all I do is pour the homemade almond milk into a container. Now that your almond milk is all done, you can keep it in the fridge for up to a week and just make sure that you shake it before you add it to your tea or beverages or whatever you're using it for. Thank you for watching this video and I will see you on my next video. Bye guys!